I'm in front of the Crucible. It's one of the coolest places in Oakland. I'm with my friends over here. Say hi. What are we doing today? Oops. Check this out. Yeah, it is. Look at that. This place is wild, folks. One of the coolest places in Oakland. Okay. See all the kind of stuff they do here? Anyway, what we're going to do is we're going to go to a little jewelry class and uh, make our own stuff. I've been here before. I made um, a really cool sunflower. It's a big warehouse. They have sculpture here, metalwork, fire, jewelry. You can make all kinds of cool stuff. Let's go over here. Hi. That's I think. Take classes, do stuff like that. So I can take either a rawhide or a plastic mallet, and this will not mar the metal, but it will flatten it. And you want the metal going like this versus curved this way because that'll push it down and just a little bit of touch and you get flattened metal. Um, we just hammer one side. Yourself a line. Every single one of these stamps are a little bit different. So if I said, you know, just put it on the line, that might work for one set, but it might not work for the other. So that's one reason why I like you guys to play. Um, we have several different sizes and also types. This type, oops, that goes over here. Um, these are Harbor Freight stamps and they have no indication to tell you which direction the letter is going. So these are ones that you're gonna wanna double check. Um, this, I don't, I don't feel like I hit that hard enough or like with some of the decorative stamps, it didn't, they, you're having a hard time getting the impression, like the smiley face, I think, is one of them. So you might want to hit around it a little bit more. Just don't move your fingers. And then give it another hit. Okay? Otherwise, you'll end up with sort of a shadow or, or going on. Now, some of Just by doing this little curvature. And then she's going to pull out a whole set of, we have these dapping tools. Um, and I'm going to use the tiniest ones for the eyes and then the big one for the nose. And just so you guys can see the contrast of what you can get by using those two different ones. So I'll pass this around in a moment. Are we recording? Okay, so what I'm doing, I'm going to make a heart. And then I'm going to put a second layer of an air screen. At least that's the plan. Get all these cool little tools. Give it a little texture. Got all these people over here. And then this is really like a famous chef. <laughs> Very cool. He's going to anneal. What does anneal mean? Annealing is softening the metal. And you do this because? So um, when you get the metal, the molecules are tightly aligned. Mm -hmm. If they, if you loosen them up, you can get the deeper texture. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. That's good. A little less, less oxygen, right there. Perfect. And he's about an inch away from the metal. You want to make sure you get evenly get your edges and your uh, middle. Mm -hmm. And that color is made is telling you how hot the metal is getting. Mm -hmm. and we're looking for a, a dull, um, very red, dull brown. And we are looking straight at the flame, we're looking at the edge of the And we pull this way Now I'm going to pick my hammer. Some of them. I have all these cheese ones. Mm -hmm. Give it a little texture on the back. Do that. We got these little doodads. Make something interesting. Okay. It's all about planning. So I am going to start with a big heart. Try 
show this, but you can see. Do you want me to take a picture? Well, it's, it's on video. Do you mind holding it for a second? Okay. okay, so what I'm doing is I'm texturizing. Okay. And as my friend said, when it starts to bend, you turn it over and flatten it out. And this is why I brought my grandglasses. That's my old principal from Casparilla High School. So back to the little project. That's my Airstream. That's my heart. And then I found that one out. I wish it was silver, but it's all good. So I'm making my Airstream. But it's starting to look like a very odd one. And now oh my I'm burning mine, and this is softening it up. Annealing. Annealing. The which is the softening. So annealing. That's annealing. our instructor. What's your name? Denise. Denise. Hi, Denise. Hi. This is going to be on postcardtravelers.com. Oh, okay. No, she said to make She's it change going colors. To make it red. And then now, what do I do after this? So um, I am not sure why you were making it red. I don't know. Okay. Well, she just um, wanted to put the fire. Right. I exactly. just wanted to do the fire. <laughs> All right. So usually, it's on that's what, uh, what? Okay. Look what she made. Don't look at her boobs, everybody. <laughs> don't look at my boobs. <laughs> it's supposed to be my little airstream. I gotta make it lighter. And it says peace. Quit looking at my boobs. Anyway. This is so cool. This is the crucible. They do so many different things here. I want to ring the bell. Watch. And then this is like a shop. The crucible. Look at that. I highly recommend coming here. Bring your kids. Bring your family, join some classes. You can do all kinds of artwork kind of stuff. See, this is a bike shop. And uh, you get to work with industrial type uh, products. So anyway, it's a rodeo weekend. So my next thing is gonna be cowboy hat. That's why I got my cowgirl shirt on kind of. Well, it is HD for $100. Peace out, baby. Coolest place in the Bay Area for sure.